Okay, so two ladies at our church are having babies, and we're making diaper bouquets, or bouquets, however you say it. And we made one, and now we're going to show you how to make another one. Okay, so this is the stuff that you're going to need to make one of those, a vase or a vase, however you say it, um, a styrofoam piece. You're supposed to use the round ones. It'd probably come out a lot easier. It took us a long time to figure out how to get it to go up, so I would just throw it around one. But I was too cheap. And then we bought flowers to like add that inside. And then tool and some skewers, bar, um, bamboo skewers and diapers. We did 50. Uh, you, if you want it to be a lot fuller, then you'd have you can buy more. And then some hair pretties, the little elastic thing, and scissors. Um, some scissors. I'm gonna just put the stuff in the bottom. So we will. I will do that, and then we will come right back. So now we're going to, I have some diapers. I did, um, I did size one diapers. Um, you can do newborns or whatever. I forgot. I'm going to put this on first. Okay. And now I'm going to do probably like 10 around. And then I do smaller going up and all the way up. Okay. Now I start, people, there are lots of people do different ways. You can go on the inside of the diaper. I do like that. I'm just going to go sure. from the the outside fat part of the diaper there all the way to the open part of the diaper because you want it to be open so that it looks more like a flower and then you just roll it on seat and it gets a kind of a rosy look you can use the clear colored ones or you can use we have, a, we have a variety of them you can't tell them once you put all the tool and all that in there um what it will look Wrap like it around twice. and then i do you can do it twice i'm just gonna do it once and then you stick it, I'm going to stick it right here in the bottom, okay? And then I'm going to get another one. We kind of cut these in half already. And then roll it, okay? Now I'm going to do a couple more and then I'll, we'll show you what that looks like when we're done. Okay, we had the first play around and I did, I think I did nine or ten around the bottom. And now I'm now I'm putting them in between each diaper. And so the same thing. And I'm also cutting my sticks in half so that um because you don't need them that long. And you just roll it again. Take a rubber band. You can double it if you want. I am not at the moment. Um and then I turn it upside down so that the the open parts at the bottom. I'm just going to put between those two. Two diapers like that. See? And then I'm going to keep going. I'm going to finish this around. Now I finished the second layer and I'm working on my third layer. I'm actually changing up the diaper thing. Um, Alright, so I'm going to I take the six and I break them in half because I don't need them that big. Um, I'm going to roll them from this way. Stubborn cat. And go over. I think it looks nicer that way. Uh, it looks cleaner to me, so I'm gonna do them that way. With the rest of them, you don't have you, know, you don't have your open. I'm gonna do them like that. And I'm gonna push it in like that. And I'm gonna go all the way. I guess you can. I'll show you a couple more. But it's really simple. It's more. It's more time consuming than it is hard, you know. So. Let me just roll it. The, when we were first doing it, it looked horrible, and I was like, I was about to cry because it, it looked awful. But once we, we then moved some diapers around and then added all our little fillers, you can add. I wanted to put washcloths in there. We did washcloths the same way, but I couldn't find any washcloths. And then um, you could do washcloths and all kinds of stuff. You can add all the little things in there if you want to. Well, it all relates to diapers because there's diaper powder and then like powder or like cream for your baby cream in the bottom, diaper cream. And then like there's diapers, so it all goes with... It all goes together. Okay. If you can see it, we're going to get starting to fill in the top and just kind of make it like a bouquet. Of I love you too. <laughs> going to just start no. making... <laughs> okay. Okay. Careful, these sticks when you cut them, they're, they're pokey. I made myself bleed a couple times. Okay. 
Oops, this one doesn't want to stay in. <laughs> okay. Oops. Okay. And you can make them different heights if you if you want to. Um, and so now I'm just filling in all this empty open. Oh, that's kind of good. I'm filling in all the empty spots. And so I'm gonna do that. That's gonna take me a couple minutes because I have the rest of those diapers to put in. And then I will come back and I will start putting the towel in. Okay, so the bouquet is done, and now I'm just, I cut, <laughs> don't mind the table, I um, cut a bunch of these tool pieces, and I'm just going to start putting them in, in dead spaces around the bouquet. Okay, so this is what it looks like with all the tool in it. I'll spin it for you. Okay, and now I'm just going to add some flowers. I'm going to break them up and then just put them around. Alright, so I've got the flowers on. There we go. And it's finished. And it didn't take us too long at all to make. Thanks for watching. Bye. Okay, so we when we were making our little pots that we made, which you guys saw that video, my mom, when she made the first one, you should have saw her face when we did videotape it. So I'm gonna tell you what her face looked like and I cracked up because it was hilarious how she did. Okay, so this is what happened. So the vase was standing right here, okay? And she's like, and she finished putting flowers and do 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 and then she's like, Oh my goodness, it's so cute! <laughs> It's just the vase. She's made. She's like, well, we came up with our own idea, and I thought it was really cute. So, yeah. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.